Light Saber back again with another video. I've got a few updates for you. Um, start with Bidal on this occasion. Okay, so Bidal uh, does look like it's going down further. If you see from my previous video, I said if it, if it drops below this level for me, it's going to be a little bit more bearish, more downside for that. People are asking me, am I still bullish on Bidal? Well, the answer is I'm not bullish until this can show me something different at the end of the day. I keep saying it, right? Uh, it's continuing in a downtrend until it proves to me that it's in an uptrend and to, be, to get into an uptrend it needs to put in higher highs and higher lows all right guys you can see that it did come up here and um, it did look like it was putting in a higher low and then it came up and it put in a lower high and continued to the downside all right so if I have an M M okay continue to the downside and um, now you can see it's actually broke this this level if we go even as far down as the wick all right guys and um, it has broken that level if we take out the wick you can see it's clearly broken that level all right guys so if that wick is nothing to count for then this is definitely going down a bit further but right now if you bring it to the bottom of the wick you can see that it's just about just about wicking back up over it all right guys if it does drop below that then you know it's probably almost certain that there's going to be further downside for buy down it's currently underneath ico price a lot of people won't be happy about that some people will look at it as a buying opportunity to pick up some cheap buy down but um, yeah i mean i've been saying it all along guys you know you can't ride these downtrends um you know fair play to you if you are and you can you know you, you're comfortable with that, with that going down even further all right but yeah for me it's not my style man i'm not looking to ride this downtrend i mean look at all this empty space over here all right that will be a disaster to see by that fall all the way down there and they don't seem to be doing much to move the price in terms of announcements in terms of uh you know innovation we're seeing things like you know socks um as to incentivize people to remain by that warriors you know there comes a time when the warrior must um choose a different path <laughs> all right guys so that's by now just a quick update on that all right guys that curve looks terrible you know it looks terrible if i was to flip this chart upside down okay and this was going in the other direction i would be super bullish on that so I'll, I'll be telling you that this looks like it's about to go parabolic all right guys so that's a technique you can use as well flip the chart upside down and see what it looks like and uh, what, what it would look like in reverse okay um and you know you'll probably probably be putting a buy on if that was the case if it's going the other way around you'll probably be you know trying to short it or you'll be looking to uh, wait until you, you can get a nice pullback or correction okay guys so that is buy down moving on to dm script just quickly all right and this is not a chart update but um just quickly actually you can see it is bouncing off this level of resistance over here it's going in kind of like a straight line sideways at the moment just got a couple of lines out okay we've got this resistance over here we have this support down here not quite but more or less okay um so if we can carry on between that range uh, that range and then you know eventually break out of it to the upside and that's bullish but um yeah if it does a buy down and goes through that line there, down there it's going to go down a little bit further in my opinion okay but um yeah the reason i wanted to just quickly um talk about dm script is i talked about this announcement where is it this announcement just yesterday. Since then, there's been a few more announcements. We've got the Higlo uh, GG demo coming soon, whatever that is. Um, we've also got an AMA um, uh, with DM Script, okay, on you know this ten Telegram channel, Moonwalker, you know the Moon or TH Moonwalkers. All right, guys. So there's a, an, an AMA for that. And whether it's happened already, I don't know. I'd have to. Oh, right, yeah, that's gone already. Sorry. Okay, and then we also have DM Script's latest partner, Sambrella Studios. Okay, whoever that is, you know, it's not quite, you know, Mercedes or, you know, but I guess it's, it's to do with this, right? Um, gaming, right? Epic Games, something epic will be announced either on the 20th, right? So they've got an out announcement coming on the 20th. All right, guys, so that's something to look out for. DM Script, if you are interested in that. 
who knows whether that will move the price, whether that will push it back into this territory over here and carry that to the upside. All right. So the coin that I haven't spoken about on the channel yet that I wanted to have a quick look into is this one. All right. Fold, F-O-L, which is Folder Protocol. All right. The only reason I want to talk about this, or, for, or two reasons actually, um, one of them being is that um, on the website, uh, it lets you know that it's basically a second layer technology on Filecoin's mainnet. If you don't know what Filecoin is, that's, that's a coin that recently got listed on uh, Binance, okay? And this is a uh, yeah, this is built on on their mainnet. All right, so you know you get Filecoin, you get Folder Coin, yeah, F O L Folder Protocol, get it? Okay. Uh, I don't want to go too much into the tokenomics and all that sort of stuff on this because it doesn't really interest me at this point. It looks like a good concept, to be honest, um, you know, if it's bouncing off Filecoin. But um, the only reason I want to kind of highlight this at the moment is uh, the fact that they are featured on Dex Tools. Uh, there's a big add up here for Folder Coin. So anyone that goes through Dex Tools, if they are paying attention to that ads, they're not going to miss it. So that's going to raise awareness of it. What I'm seeing here is it came up. All right, and what it's doing is it seems to be going sideways, which kind of says to me that this could be looking for another leg to the upside, maybe a big leg like that. All right, guys, but don't quote me on that. That's not 100%. Um, but I do look for this kind of sideways consolidation um, after the, I mean, it didn't just fall all the way to the downside, all right, like we see with a lot of coins. It is holding up. All right, guys, so it's found some support. It's found a little bit of strength and stability. It's going sideways. However long that goes for, I don't know it could still fall to the downside but for me I like these kind of kind of chart setups because you know it kind of gets you ready this is accumulation it gets you ready for a pump to the upside the volume is quite low all right guys but I'll just give you one comparison okay let's have a look at this coin here crypto lock all right we talked about this on the channel it has gone down since this actually did get to around 4k almost 5k all right but um, you know it's a little bit more choppy but you can see this sideways action right so it comes all the way up like that I'll just show you what I'm looking at quickly okay so we've got the pump that little pump to the upside okay let's just make sure that was a big pump there yep we are looking at approximately 300 odd percent 350 percent okay now it didn't just fall all the way to the downside now bearing in mind this one is like less liquidity and a lot more volatile okay but you see that sideways that sideways that sideways consolidation all right and then eventually you get a massive pump to the upside okay and that took it all the way up to over 5k all right guys so that's the kind of thing that i'm looking at with folder coin okay it came up it didn't completely die off it's come up after it um, um, dipped over here so the dip got bought up now it's consolidating sideways and you could potentially see uh, a massive move to the upside and that's just in theory okay that's not 100% um, guaranteed or anything like that but I will be watching it closely for a move like that and obviously you know if I got that right then then that could make you a little bit of money but that's about it um, stay tuned for tomorrow's video okay got some uh, interesting news and important announcement for my own cryptocurrency project um, so I'm going to let you guys know what's going on tomorrow okay so you have to tune in to hear that follow me on Twitter follow me on Instagram details are on the screen you can also become a patreon that gets you access to the telegram group all right guys and yeah I'll see you in the next video